Hello everyone, today I'm going to be showing you the fastest way to change the props on your FPV quadcopter. So there are a lot of prop nut tools out there that either have like a one-way bearing in them or some kind of ratcheting mechanism. And for these methods I'm going to show you, you don't need any of that. We're going to change props just as fast or faster just by using a normal prop nut driver with no kind of ratcheting or one-way bearing inside. So with that said, let's go ahead and see the fastest way to change your props. Okay, so being able to change your props quickly starts with a good grip on your motor and prop. So one thing you want to do is grab the motor in line with the arm. And what I mean by that is basically come in with your hand and grab the motor like so. All right, because if you come in at an angle, the arm itself gets in the way and then you have a hard time grabbing onto the motor. So if you come in along the line of the arm, you can kind of get around the arm given that they're not too fat and grab the motor a lot more securely. Another thing you should do is basically wrap your hand around one of the blades of your props. And what this allows you to do is not only get a good grip on the motor, but it also allows you to grab onto the prop and motor at the same time for that first turn when you're trying to get the prop knot loose and it's really tight, it gives you a little bit of extra leverage to get that tight prop knot off. Once again, we wanna come in along the line of the arm and grab onto one of the blades and the prop at the same time. And I use basically this part of my thumb and then kind of the fat part of my pointer finger uh, to grab onto the motor so it's nice and secure. And now we just unscrew for the first turn, but here's where it gets a little fancy. So instead of releasing with this hand um, or just taking this off and then resetting it, what we wanna do is actually release with the hand that's holding the motor and then we're just going to spin the motor with our prop driver while holding the prop in place. And then we're going to grab back onto the motor, unscrew, release the motor, screw in, but we're not actually screwing in because we're just letting the motor spin freely. And then we just repeat. So grab it, unscrew, release, screw in. And we can just do this and it's very fast. It's just as fast as any kind of fancy ratcheting, prop nut driver, whatever, so you don't need that. So now the prop's off, we want to put it back on. It's the same exact process in reverse. Get your nut started, and then we're gonna grab the motor, screw in, and now we're going to release and unscrew instead of releasing and screwing in. So once again, it's just the reverse. Then we grab the motor again, screw in, release, unscrew, and then we just Tighten it all the way back up. And then for this last turn, once again, we're grabbing onto the blade of the propeller itself so that we can, you know, get a good amount of torque onto that nut so that our props don't come loose during flight. That is all there is to it. Let me just do one little change at full speed so you guys can see how it should look. All right, props off. props on. All right, so I hope you guys learned a little something about a very effective way to change your props without any kind of fancy tools. So if you like this video, please like it and please get subscribed to see more content like this in the future. Thanks for watching.